Hi guys, so today um, I've been having a bit of a sort out. Um, I'm trying to get a bit more organised than I am. Um, and I have got piles and piles of scrap paper and I really don't know what to do with it. It's just cut off bits from where I've been making things. Um, leftover bits like this, even bits of doily here that I've tea stained or coffee stained. Um, and bits that I've printed on. But I just don't like to throw them away. So what I thought I'd do, um, obviously this is nothing new, but I just thought I'd just pop the camera on to show you what I've been up to. I'm just making some little scrap notepads. Um, they can just be really nice just to pop into your journals or into anything. And if you saw my last video on the little flip books, um, they look really good in here. So instead of putting like a pocket here, you could stick in one of these little booklets um, with all your little scraps on and they just fit perfect like that so um, and I thought they look really really nice so it's another little addition to go into your little flip books um, and these are really really easy peasy and you just use up all your little scraps as well of your lace and trim on here so I've got probably about 10 pieces of just scrap um, leftover paper um, and I've just popped a little bit of lace on here, got a little bit of seam binding on there um, which looks really nice and this has just got some scrap lace on but you don't have to put anything on top you could just leave it blank and then just have these all ready and then when you when you make a journal or little pocket packs or anything you're making you could actually just pop all the little bits on to, to um, match in with whatever you're making so I think these are really good sort of little um, stash project. So, right, what we got, let's have a look. So I'm just going to take some bits and pieces. So there we go, this piece that I've just used, um, that I've stamped over the top. Um, I've just sort of used half of it. It doesn't matter if you've got these little bits. So what I do, I've just popping sort of like, what did I say, about 10 pieces, I think, on top, like this just pop it over and what I'm going to do is just tear that little bit off pop that piece on there let's just make that just a little bit shorter and then that piece can go on there so what's that one two three four five pieces like that um, got another piece there six that one's just got that's just doubled over a piece that I've used on there and what we've got here what's these pieces here look let's just rip a piece of this off to go on there like that and then one more piece we can just have let's have a little piece like this to go on top okay so we've got one two three four five six seven eight nine got ten pieces and i think um, that's just got a nice little size because it's not too heavy and all i've done i've got my stapler um, and i'm just going to staple the top so there's no sewing or anything like that so you can just make up bundles of these um, and keep them in your stash and then you can just sort of like decorate them to however you want or let's have a look i've got my little stash of ribbon and lace and bits of off cuts here and then what have I got in here I've got all my sort of bits of seam binding that I've got left over on here um, little flowers all your leftovers just get all your little bits of leftovers um, and add them to the top so here we go we've got a little bit of white lace here so we can just stick a piece on like that so let me get my three in one glue hope you can see this there we go so let's just stick that across like that what did i do with it here we go stick it on top like so just cut it to size like that okay and then what can we have we can have a little little bow so we have a little pink one like this so just use all your little bits so it's all just like a little scrappy notebook um, like so so it's 
just a quick easy project just to use up you can use if you've got little scrapbook papers or anything like that you can pop those in as well um, anything any bits of paper oops easy pop that out of the way and then look just pop that onto there like that and then we have another little little notebook I thought these are great like that and they make nice little little gifts as well because on this one look I've actually got a little tag I just popped a little tag and I got a bit of doily these rip quite easily and it ripped at the top so I thought I just cut it off straight and then just stuck it on and then I've got a little tag on there you could even write something on the back of that so I thought they would look really nice and then we go we've got another one to go into our stash so I thought they look really pretty really quick really easy let's pop all these back and let's make another one. Oh, that's quite pretty isn't it right let's have a look let's just tear this piece down here and we can have that piece piece on there just put that one on the back so you can make them whatever size you like, you like depending on what size um, scrap bits of paper that you've got like that try and get it sort of straight as possible so that's got two pieces in so obviously I've torn that off something so that goes in there so we've got two four six there's a piece there let me just tear that off use a piece of this as well tear that down put that one at the top Let's tear that little bit off there because it's a little bit too long I think because I like to see these sort of like um, layers at the bottom so what we've got we've got two four six eight let's have another piece of this and then what I can you do let's Pop a piece of this on the top. Like that. Let me just tear that so it's a little bit shorter. So look at that. Doesn't that look nice? Pop those to the side. And then we get our stapler. I think I'll pop two staples in this side. One either side like that. So there we go. So just make them up like this. I won't decorate that one. I'm just going to leave that there because I'd like to use these in my journal that I'm going to be making. Um, sort of, sort of like a shabby, shabby journal. But I'm not quite sure what I'm going to be popping in it. So these can just go like this. Little tiny bits on there. So we've got that way so long bits big square bit there let's have a piece of this let's go that way and one more piece what should we have on top there we go have that like that maybe a little bit like that okay oops get the stapler pop a little staple in and there we go so look I even got one of these look cut out so you could even stick these on top which would look nice so look perfect so there we go guys just a quick little project just something to add into your into your um, journals um, and I think they look really nice so just use lots of little bits of your leftover fabrics or your trims that you've got left over any ripped pieces of paper or doilies and here got odd bits of seam binding that I had and bits of lace um, so I think they look really really nice this one has just got um, odds, odds of lace on there 
with a little bit of, of resin rose on there and then that one's got one of my little seam binding flowers on so there we go quick easy project for you um, and don't forget if you're going to be making these little flip books they are perfect perfect to go in there like that and then they just fold up nicely so that you can see it inside all right guys well i hope you give it a go use up all your little bits and pieces it's a nice little project for um an evening quick and easy um i will see you soon and thank you for joining me all right bye bye